we are all part of a large system. The work we do may be different. Sometimes our own work seems too big to our eyes. Without me, we would be thinking that this ship would not work. Of course not. In a factory, the smallest wheel is as important as the biggest one. Hey friends, welcome back to our Sunday motivational video. 2020 has become the year of awakening. We learned how fragile our lives are. It made everyone realize how fragile livelihood is. You know what they say, for the first time by chance, for the second time of your choice. So today we help you set personal goals for this year. Before we start the list, take a piece of paper and a pen. We want you to write it next to each one. Write how this specifically relates to your reality. We will be reviewing the list at the end of the year and you will be amazed at what happens. Let's begin. Here are 15 important goals for new year. Number one, increase your income by at least 50%. People who strive to increase their income 10 times. Income crazy or even makes the numbers ridiculously low. For those of you who are already wise, on your journey, 50% is more than just a far-fetched destination. To do this, you need to expand your skills. Why? Because when you did well, you don't have 50% extra hours, so you just can't prepare for that goal. To do this, of course, you need to be more organized, plan better, and maybe work a little more. But, the difference that this jump in income will make in your life will be noticeable. For us personally, 50% is a growth indicator when it comes to medium and large indices. Write how much money you earned on a piece of paper last year. And what 50% growth will look like. Write it down. Now that you have the number, it's up to you. Divide it into exactly what it takes to get there. Number 2. Developing a new source of income that can grow. In the past year, many people have struggled to put all of their eggs in one basket. Don't be like these people. If you want to be financially free, you should try to create a new income stream every three years. And take the time to create it. Once you have two of these, focus on those with the highest income or long-term potential. A higher income can be make you rich, but multiple sources of income will make you rich. The biggest mistake people make when deciding on a new source of income is that they expect you to earn the same money they do. Earn money from your current job or business. This is not the case. We said that once and will repeat it again. Passive income of $100 is more than $1,000 in earned income. Setting goals makes me clear, gives me the opportunity to ask myself what I want to think about and get motivated too. How is the annual goal determined? Where do we go wrong when we set an annual goal? I will discuss topics like Number 3. Clean up your home, literally and figuratively. Chaos slows you down. You have too much, you try to do too much, and you are not making any real progress? This needs to be changed. When you are poor, you believe that the more things you have, the richer you will be. You have to go a long way to realize that it was the other way around. What you own will eventually become yours, because it takes time and effort. Here is a simple example to show this point. One share is worthless, but if it is only in the middle of the room, you still have to stop what you're doing. Get him, find out where his friend is, or at least decide what to do with him. This suck costs you your life and your brain power for only a few minutes. You extrapolate this to your full existence and suddenly you realize how little it is. The time you spend on yourself and the cost of transporting excreta. Ask your mom and she will tell you how much effort and time it takes to tidy up the house. Start with your real home, clean up the mess, and fix what needs to be repaired or replaced, if you can afford it. After you finish your physical lifestyle, organize your schedule and mind. One of our personal goals for the next 12 months is, double the money, but only half of the property. Hash number 4, automate. Or outsource a time-consuming task. I've done a lot of repetitive and boring work over the past year. Time to find someone to take this Bourdain off your shoulders. If you think your abilities are better than your current existence, time to build around it. The whole team can deliver. This is because you are a very limited person. You cannot be in two places at the same time, and no matter how hard you work, you only have 24 hours a day. Learn to use leverage. 10 people on your team increase this 24 hours to 240. 
The only thing better than hiring people is automating repetitive tasks. Someone is not going to work around the clock every day. But they will be programs, they will be robots, and this is the time we live in. What do you add to yourself every day in the process? And in what framework do you shape your personality, soul, heart, mind, and thoughts, and nurture your will to choose what? Here's what to focus on. We all have different filters for perception here, but what are the topics that we will focus on, and that will develop after passing the exams? What do we need most? What path would you choose in the new year, in the new 12 months and 365 days, exactly? How much could you use to achieve your goals? Number 5. Learn one new skill that will benefit your life. If you want to get the most out of this year, we strongly encourage you to hone your skills. Don't force yourself to learn a lot of things, just one skill is enough to accumulate for the rest of your life. Notice skills, accumulate throughout your life. Once, you have mastered a skill, no one can take it. You will reap the benefits again and again. Here are three game-changing skills we discovered on our journey. Reflect on sales and negotiations. Patterns of mental development to be in harmony. We always recommend thinking about the long term. If you can realize this year, the only thing that will spark interest in the next few years this will prove to be one of the best decisions you can make. This is exactly why we built our learning platform. We want you to be able to master the skills as needed. Just choose what is long. The term you want to master and we provide you with everything you need. Number 6. Traveling to a new country. Travel has a magic advantage. This allows our thoughts to expand, and when that happens, our goals expand as well. This is why we highly recommend choosing and going to a country you have never visited before. We know that the CBD virus has severely restricted your ability to travel, but based on our experience we have found that. This excursion is now more convenient, prices are lower than usual, and there are fewer tourists. The security measures in place go beyond what you can get at your local shopping center. An added bonus is that you can reflect on your life and immerse yourself in new cultures. Travel, travel far. Talk to people, hear their stories, and you will all grow. A day spent away from a comfortable but boring life. Always choose the country you want to travel to and write it down. Find out the cost of flights, choose the cool look. The Airbnb you want to stay on vacation with. Thus desires turn into plans. Number 7. Add a new piece to your online puzzle. Relationships are very important. We are moving fast towards an inner circle community. Basically, if you're in the right amount, you'll be fine otherwise. You have to find out for yourself. Before the end of the year, make it a priority to make a valuable new connection. You don't have to force it, but position yourself so that the result is to be expected. Events do not happen, but they do not prevent you from chatting online. The challenge is to find 10 people you think are inspiring and follow them. Social media, see how their lives are going. Even if they don't get back to you, you can still see what you think is valuable on the inside. Everyone says making new friends is difficult, because everyone expects friends who are perfect, and her gang will appear at your doorstep and make you a part of their team. But friendship is not built this way. It's about being in the right place at the right time. And if you stay home, you will still get the same indoor type results. Number eight, read one more book from 2020. Rich reads, you want to be rich. You have to be able to do that too. How many books have you read in the last year? Could you be true to yourself? We will not tell you. Read 30 books as that would be ineffective. Just try to get over your past accomplishments. This is how we think. Books are a window to the future from the perspective of the past. We make use of the books that we read 5 to 10 years ago. You never know how a book can have a butterfly effect on your existence. An idea you get from a book, podcast, or class can make a big difference in your life. If you enjoy listening to books, join book groups and sign up. If so, your friends at Audible are giving you an audiobook for free. Number 9. Minimize your social media. Use social media 20% less than you used last year. And let this be a start. At the end of the year, we checked screen time in Apple settings and were shocked. 
Yes, our business is digital so, we have to spend more time on the internet than usual. But this is shocking, how much time do you spend on social networks or playing monotonous games on your phone? The truth is, in the, the more time you spend on social media, the more unhappy and antisocial you will become. What we found the most was, deleting accounts that we found attractive and engaging, replace them with people who inspire us and art. If we go to social media now, it will fulfill us thinking and then thinking makes us better. Basically, we turn everything we consume into a gem. As a result, we were able to spend less time on these super exciting platforms and more time in the present. And we won't be able to tell you how wonderful it is to live your life instead of looking at life through filters others are feeding you. Hash number 10, let go of a bad habit. Go to the gym, quit smoking, earn money, find a partner, learn to play the guitar, and invest in cryptocurrencies or real estate. And by the end of February, you can say this will be a repeat of last year. Which bad habit brings you the most frustration when looking at your life? Take a moment to fix this. You'll likely find more than one, write them all. If you look at this list, which one has the most positive impact on your existence? Is it no longer a part of your life? So you have to choose. Leave everything as it is, and don't try to do everything but focus on a habit you need. There are other people who have managed to finish what you are trying to end. Find them, find out what worked for them, and find what works for you. Stop wasting a lot of money, stop eating too much junk food, stop getting addicted. The long-term return from this decision pays off a hundred times if you do everything right. Everyone says they want to invest in themselves. Well, here's your chance to do just that. Hash number 11, make a long-term investment. If you can get at least part of your income and grow it safely in the future, why not seize the opportunity to do it more than ever this year? It might seem a little overwhelming at first, but at first glance, everything looks like this. Only you Google and learn the basics. Then build on that knowledge before you pull the trigger. You can, bought real estate that provides passive income for our grandchildren. Can bought stocks and invested in index funds that will do so let the money grow for us over the next decade. Can bought bitcoins that will remain intact until your children grow up. Make a long term investment now or keep paying more. Number 12, find someone new to inspire you. You may not find a mentor for a while, but if you are disciplined, you don't need a mentor, you need a hero, someone to inspire and aspire to. Study them, find out what they do, or they care about them, and what steps they take a company. We live in a golden age for content. Hence, it is very likely that they appeared on a podcast somewhere or gave a video interview. This is a very high quality, expensive, and freely available training. We like to find people who inspire us because they spent money and learned throughout their lives what you have access to now. You are what you consume. Hash number 13, stress management. We all agree 2020, it was a year so busy. It seemed like two years more than one year. This led us to pay more attention to stress levels, workload and health. You're worried about an occasional work issue today and the next day. The government tells everyone that they cannot leave their homes or see relatives. It sets the record straight, especially when other people are counting on you. Managing stress should be a priority for each of you. The formula that suits us best consists of three elements, stop cluttering calendars, we're dividing calendars again. The body should feel refreshed with exercise. And what do we eat? Meditation and mindfulness. All of these things together drive us forward without feeling crazy. You don't have to be a monk or a fitness junkie. You just need to pay more attention to them. As for those of you who feel that, you need help at the end of the meditation. Joining a friend group will help you switch from a beginner meditate every day and protect the chain for 41 days. Everything is easier afterwards. We know, a rude plug-in, but these friendship and taking action allow us to keep everyday content for free. Hash number 14, make giving to helping someone else a priority. Not a year should pass without your positive influence on another person. This is what we learn it directly. Everything you offer will be back 10 times over the next few years. Every time we introduced it, the market god universe, whatever you call it, gave us more. As if the upper management of the universe counted. We are aware of the distribution of happiness, and we choose you as a mediator. Give money, give time, give love, just give. 
there is also a hidden happiness balance. Sometimes, even a little effort on your part brings good luck to someone else. If the price is lower than the result you will win lucky, so do it often. Hash number 15, the family should always come first. Coronavirus has killed more people in the past 9 months than influenza in the past 10 years. If your family goes through this without sacrifice, you may not realize how happy and lucky you are. Spend more time with the people you love, and make an effort to date more. Listen more than you say, make plans together, and let your relationship blossom. The mental benefit that a loving family can provide is incredible. It also serves as a reliable and secure support system in case something goes wrong. These are all very important goals for you to set, and we sincerely hope so. Most of you will pre-check at least some of them off the list. The new year draws to a close and leads us to today's question, which of these will make your priority? We can't wait to hear your response in the comments. For those of you who watch this from new year, until the end. This is a bonus. You deserve it. Bonus. Fashion. Breaking news. Changing trends. We live in a rapidly developing consumer world where it is extremely stressful for a person's soul to catch up with everything at the same pace. Innovation is of course refreshing, but without understanding what is there, the constant concern for what we cannot achieve, and the desire to achieve what we do not, really overwhelm the value of our values. Remember, happiness and health are the new rich. We wake up slower and slower to find that the money is no longer there valuable as before of course you still need it and a must for both of you get this so you don't have to worry about money issues but it's no longer an all-in game if all you have is money you lose anyway the true rich today have three happiness health and wealth first of all you should be looking for the money because it is the direct shareholder affect your existence but don't neglect the other two because you can. My friend, you may not be able to receive before the time is up. After this video ends, think about your life to that point. And its magnitude. Your time is still ahead. If you have over 30 years to spare, enjoy the benefits. Position yourself as a temporary billionaire. And figure out how to plan for the medium to long term. However, people always overestimate what they can do in a year. Reduce it. Think about what they can do in 10 years. New year, start a new decade for you. Make sure your life increases here. As for our personal goal, we look forward to launching the Goal Mastery this quarter for you to play. Everyone will benefit from this and greatly increase your chances of achieving new goals. Please write your comments below, which will inspire everyone. We thank you. My friends, please subscribe the channel. Like and write comment in below. Thank you.